Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Poigie here getting ready to take out the USSR T44 and ground RB at 6.7. Uh, I have some boosters that were expiring, so I figured I'd run them and uh, see how it goes. This is the very first drive out in this tank. I've got nothing in it, not the best rounds yet, etc. So not expecting a whole lot, but uh, looks like it's got a decent amount of armor for 6.7. Um, the round, once we get the better APCB APCBC round um, will actually do a little bit of damage so let's take it out and see what we can do with it alright so the map is abandoned town we have a full down tier I haven't seen that in a while since I've been playing reserve we're going to take the left hand spawn go towards alpha kind of hide behind this hill right here the hardest part is not getting messed up in that jamboree Good. We've got our Tiger II squad mate with us. That'll help. That's the one thing about playing reserves all the time. There's just never, every time it's a full up tier. It's the only way it can go. Alright, so we're up against America and Israel. Get a little more left before we get ourselves into trouble. That looks like the rock formation we want to be behind there. So this has an 85 millimeter gun. Should do a little bit of damage. Love to throw already on A, but we don't have it. Saw that mark. No, there's a guy looking this way over here. And good old Russian gun depression means we don't have any. So we gotta get somewhat up on the flat ground here. Just kinda keep an eye. It sounds like he's backing off, but I'm not 100%. like to go in that gully on the other side there as well. I think that's where he might be going. Yeah, no eyes on him. I think he backed away to the other side of the rocks. We usually have people watching up here though. So when you get up to the higher rank tanks, you gotta take it a lot slower, which is not my favorite thing. You go arm in arm with this guy, he doesn't slam me into a rock. Two of us gave him the one, two. Here's something down to the right. Let's be stupid and try and get across here. So if I don't get across. Ooh, I thought I was late on that. But we got it. Take an alpha, definitely a guy over there. Firing this machine gun like a silly boy. Just kind of watch the road for now. Know that there's one in the water. Call out whatever we can for our teammates. Helps us if they kill things and don't die. More people to watch our backs. Start to see some fire come from this way. There he is. This is barrel. Just hoping I get that gun port. I think maybe I did. Alright, so our lines are kind of drawn now. We've got the middle ground. 
Got good cover here. I don't see any need to push. Uh, a few things down there, though, on the road. Let's see if we can't try and help repair this guy without putting ourselves in harm's way. I think we can do it. Neutral, buddy. Neutral. Still alive at the moment. Let's go ahead and check back in over here. Seems clear. Something's over there. It's pretty much the shot I wanted other than hitting his track. Guy in front of us got popped. That was a friendly. Let's back off for a second. Oh, this thing needs a stabilizer. Um, Alright, they're on Bravo. He's scouted. Both of our buddies next to us just got popped. And I hear an engine. And I just got shot in the face. Oh shit. Hi, buddy. All right, we're pretty screwed at this point. Let's just give them our back. I'm gonna get in the cap to hopefully be able to repair the gun. So I don't even have parts yet. I can't really fix it. Only fix it to red, I think. But it's part of just starting out. Oh no, that was a full fix. I guess if you're in the cap, you get a full fix. Thanks for the heads up. Side shot on the Sherman or the M51. Their frontal armor is uh, not a lot of armor, but. It's got good slope on it. Alright, another M51 down. I hear a guy creeping on me. There he is. Hopefully he doesn't have the gun depression. Swing and a miss. Open on a fast reload. Oh, nice bomb. <laughs> Why was that bomb timer so damn long? It scared the shit out of me. Thank you, buddy. Alright, so trying to fix our barrel yet again. Alright, they're getting a little lower on players. That's good. That guy shooting us is not so good. But... Our barrel was broken. Guess we could have hid better in Alpha. Alright, so Cipred is, we're at Abandoned Town, we're in the IL-10 1946. We've got two 250s on us. And 23mm with armor piercing. Got a low visibility. Let's see. Don't see what he wants me to see. I do see that plane though. And then put flaps on to help get through that turn a little faster. He's using the cloud. He bombed himself. Let's try and get a few shots in him before he dies. Nope, no luck. Alright, scout a guy next to our T-50. I'm going to bring it off a WEP for a minute. Cool the engine down. I see the scout, but I don't see the plane. 
drop a bomb, hopefully on the right side of it. There we go. AA over there. I'm going to follow the Yak-1 in. Hope the AA gets after him. No such luck. we got to break off. We're going to get screwed. Go ahead and put our wet back on. Semi vertical turn. Not a very good one. So there should be an AA in here somewhere. Guy who scouted just smoked our guy. We got one bomb left. We're going to try it. I think that's a good drop. Yep, he's down. All right, so we still have our 23 millimeter uh, armor piercing. They can get through quite a bit of stuff. I would love to see where that AA ended up. Last I saw, he's somewhere in front of us over here. We're down to about five guys. Here, a plane to my left, which is not good. We're not well positioned to fight right now. Yep. Get those flaps going. Definitely have a lot more support than he does. That's the only thing we got going for us. It's like a bear cat. Hey, directly underneath us. It was a bear cat. He's down. All right, so where'd that AA go? It's somewhere around there. Come on, flaps. There he is. Ah, too late. Starting to come around on him. Those just must be camouflages you get for not having played in a while. They must have unlocked a bunch. All right, so let's take a look. We ended up with five kills in the T-44. That was our first uh, drive out in it, so I'm very happy with that. A couple bomb kills in the IL-10. Ended up getting Heavy Metal Hero second place on the team. That's it. Hope you guys enjoyed the video, and I'll catch you on the next one. America! Fuck yeah! To say this fucking day, yeah! Beautiful.